Cassidy with Windermere Mill Creek. I am here at our town center location. I am here with our first episode of Coffee Talk with Brian O'Donnell. Um, hi, Brian. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Thanks for having me. You're welcome. <laughs> um, he has joined our team just recently, so we're super excited to have you part of our office. Um, so this is just the first episode that we're doing as an icebreaker just to kind of uh, get you guys to uh, know our agents, get to uh, have you know what we do in the community um, and get a little bit personal and also do some real estate talk as well. So um, so my first question is, what do you uh, love about being in real estate in general yes. that, that you like? about it yeah absolutely uh, the things that have what really triggered the start of my career was I when I bought my first home our agent um, first off it was a referral my, it was my dad's frat brother um, and he was a great in his in his process in his step taking um, to make sure that I, me as a first-time home buyer um, really understood what I was doing right and that's really what started my interest mm -hmm. and piqued my interest. Um, and then from there, it's really I, I enjoy helping my friends, family, and people they send to me uh, right. kind of achieve what they're looking for in, in their biggest transaction of their lives. Yeah, I mean, it's a home. It's for, forever, right. you think, right? Right. And then, you know, referral-based is what we are about. So yes. getting those friends and family referrals are super important for us. Absolutely. So, yeah. Yep. Very nice. Yeah. Good. Um, so what would you say you really love the most about our office? Yeah. Uh, our office specifically uh, has a great sense of community and kind of the team atmosphere. Um, while we are, you know, independent contractors and agents ourselves, um, everyone tends to help out and in yeah. some sort of way that is beneficial to everyone and Chris and Deanna our designated brokers have done a great job in educating us newer agents and giving us the tools so that we're not thrown to the fire like a lot of other yeah. agencies yeah. are they definitely have a great mentor program they do the one thing I love about our office is just you know you're just kind of held by the hand you really are given all the tools that you need to right be right and we have a you know there's some other you know things on the back end we have a great social media team uh, here yeah. as well yeah. um, in our in our office staff uh, Jessica Nikki and uh, even Sherry our transaction coordinator just yeah. having those resources um, available to us down the hallway is yes. is very is very nice good good I'm glad to hear that that makes me happy yeah. <laughs> since we're the social media team yeah. Scott's behind the cam camera, by the way. Scott rocks. Okay, what do you think um, sets us apart from others? You know, I know that question maybe kind of ties into the last question I just asked, but what what specifically kind of that you think in your head sets us apart from everybody else? Yeah, I think it has to do with that mentor program um, and just having, you know, like I said, those tools and those resources that, um, you know, if you don't know a question uh, or an answer to a question, like I've had a lot lately, uh, right. <laughs> being newer. Yes. Um, Finding those answers just down the hall or is, is very, very nice and very um, key, I think, in what, what sets us apart right. from others. Yeah, the camaraderie in our office and just being able just to go down the hall and ask a question, you know, especially to some of our seasoned, seasoned agents. Right. They're always willing to help, so we do, I do take pride in that right. office for sure. Good, good. Okay. Um, next question. What do you think your clients would say you do the best? Uh, communicate. I uh, that's that's something that I've kind of hammered home with myself, and and also transparency as well as um, just letting them know, you know, where we're what what's going on. Um, I had a client who came to me strictly because the last time they were looking, uh, communication with their with their previous agent communication was lacking, um, and so from that onset point is basically when I was like, we're gonna. 
we're going to talk and we're going to talk frequently. Yeah, um, oh, that's great. That's important. Yeah. Yeah. That's so a good quality to have. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Over the phone, it's not. It's not. I. You know, I'll text when I need to, but, but most of the time you were most of the phone. I'm call, the picking phone. up the phone and calling. Do you utilize FaceTime? Do you utilize Zoom at all? I, I utilize FaceTime more than than Zoom. Um, FaceTime is a great tool, by the way. Right. FaceTime. Yeah. That's. It's been super nice, and and you know with with COVID and everything. Um, obviously, you gotta utilize your, the technology at your at your fingertips, and so um, being able to share a, an offer, review, or um, any kind of documents via Zoom, and just talk about it on the spot rather than yeah. send it by email, and then four hours later, right. um, when you're waiting for a response, and right? That stuff, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, so it makes it very, pretty yeah. immediate. Technology is awesome. Um, so now we are going to get into some personal questions. Oh, joy. <laughs> <laughs> um, so what is your hobby? I know we were talking earlier about the things that you like, but what do you like to do? What's your hobby that you do outside yeah. real estate? Well, um, my wife and I have two dogs, and so they're a hobby in and of themselves um, because they're just a handful. Um, <laughs> we have one golden retriever and one uh, Bernadoodle, and Little so Bernadoodle. yeah, and so they're 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 a ton of fun. Um, in the fall, I love football. Um, with a sports background, it's kind of Saturdays and Sundays when I'm not working. It's going to be carving some me time out to um, to watch some sports, nice. um, and then um, in the spring and summer, I really love to golf, and so, nice. yeah, it's kind of the, I like to stay busy yeah. outside of work as well. Yeah. And being outside here mm -hmm. is like key, right. you know, to our area for sure. So right. Good. Yeah. Good. Nice. Um, let's see. So do you, what do you like to do for fun though? I know you said that's your hobby. What do you do for fun? Well, I feel like your hobbies have to be fun. <laughs> so golfing. Uh, golfing is kind of, uh, yeah, it's, it's there. Um, it's really what I just enjoy. And, um, and being with family. Just being with family yeah. and, um, you know, trying at some point where, where, where we live is, you know, a mile from the beach. And so nice. trying to get on the water, if at all possible, yeah. is, yeah. is always nice as well. Yeah. And so it is nice to be close to the water for sure. Yeah. Good. Okay. Okay. Um, so what inspires you or who inspires you? Is there anything specific that inspires you? And if so, is that, some, is that somebody or is it something? That's a really good question. <laughs> that Here's a little insider sheet. I got a lot of pre-questions, so I knew it was coming. And I, this is the hardest one I've had to answer. But um, I think a lot of it's my family, um, my, my parents and grandparents. I've done a really good job of kind of instilling a good set of core values that um, I would like to live by, and um, it's that's I think you know kind of the, the the base of it. But my wife is a huge inspiration for me. Um, oh, I love that. Yeah, she she just goes out there and kicks butt every single day, and um, kind of with what propelled me into this career was the sense of entrepreneurship, and she has that herself, and. Yeah. Um, Getting her to push me or push that over the edge was kind of a entrepreneurship. That's a hard one to do. If right. anybody has got their own business, they know that it's not an easy thing to do. So having somebody to back you up, right, and know what it takes is nice. Right, and she's yeah. you know she's always in it's always in we're always in each other's corners, yeah. and so yeah. um, good. I got to meet your wife the other day, and yes. she's so super sweet. I yes. <laughs> She's yes. Um, okay, well that really wraps up all the questions that I have for you today. I do have a bonus question. Bonus like question. To... I love bonus questions. <laughs> okay, let's do that. <laughs> um, extra credit. What would you say, now I'm going to put you on the spot, what would you say um, are your special specialties of service? Um, that's a good question. Besides communication, because I know you already said communication. Yeah, I know you're good at that, but what are your other specialties that you... Yeah, well, um, you know, I, I take a lot of value, pride and value in what I bring to the table when it comes to um, being detailed and providing education for, you know, the buyers and sellers that, I be, that I'm working with. And so um, if they have any kind of questions or anything 
providing them, you know, statistics. Right. So very thorough. You're, be, you're being very thorough. Correct. Your clients. Nice. Yeah. Good. Good. Well, I like that, and I'm so glad that you were part of our team. Yeah. Thank you. Yes. Yeah. Thank you again, Scott and Chastity, for having me. Yeah. I think this thank is. Thank you uh, for being with us on our first coffee talk. Yeah. So I'm so excited. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, awesome. everybody, thank you so much for being with us today, and I will see you guys next time. Thank you, Brian. Yeah. Thank you.